Islam will never rule. They will only ever be subservient to Russia, China, the West, Europe, and the United States. They will never have the upper hand. And if you're going to defeat Israel, your only hope is to get help from Russia. So you're going to have to bow down to Russia. You're going to have to bow down to China. Bow, you, you Muslims. Right now, even right now, Iran is bowing to Russia. Please give us nuclear weapons. Please. Even right now, Iran is on their knees before Russia. That's right, I said it. You want nuclear power? You want nuclear capability? You better be ready to bend over in front of Russia and take your pants down and bend over in front of Russia. That's right, I said it. Take your pants down, Islam, and bend over in front of Russia for your nuclear capabilities. Because that's the only way you're going to get it. I said that. Muhammad. He ain't nothing but a, but a lying fool. The Koran is nothing but a book of lies. There's no way that God is with Islam. There's absolutely no way. How are you going to tell me that Islam has been defeated by Israel every single war? Now, I know as a Muslim, as a jihadist, as a radical Muslim, you're probably watching this and you are probably got some friends with you and you're thinking, we should kill this guy. You want to kill me? Of course you do. Of course you do. That's what you guys do. And that's why you end up being killed. Go ahead. Come get me. But just remember, when Osama bin Laden and Mohammed Atta and his little group of buddies decided that they were going to destroy the World Trade Center, not only were they killed, but the United States went after them and followed them to Iraq, Afghanistan, Pakistan, completely destroyed whole towns and cities. You want to kill me? Of course you do. That's what you are. You're, you're a beastly animal that wants to kill anybody who just barely insults you. Even if I, write, if I were to draw a little cartoon that said Muhammad with a little bomb on his head, you'd want to kill me. If I was a Christian, you'd want to kill me. If I was a Jew, you'd want to kill me. If I was an unbeliever, you'd want to kill me. What can I do to not be, want, to, to not be killed by you guys? So you put everybody in a situation where it's kill or be killed. And guess what? I have more power than you. I remember there was a group of guys who bombed one of uh, a, a United States ship, and they were on a little tiny dinghy, little motorboat, and they pulled up beside the this big old, uh, I think it was like some sort of cruiser, and they blew themselves up, and nobody in the ship was even hurt. <laughs> it was like, are you serious? Now there was a hole in the side of the ship, yeah, <laughs> but. They just killed themselves. <laughs> it's just like, are you serious? Because I know that with all your intellect and all your resources and all your power, you're going to end up dead before you get me. You're going to get arrested. You're going to blow yourself up. You're going to be a suicide bomber. It's probably some other Muslim who's more radical than you is going to think you're not radical enough and kill you and behead you. I mean, who knows? If you're a Shiite, it's probably going to be a Sunni who's going to come get you. And you're, you're going to be on your way to come get me. <laughs> it's, that's, how, that's how ridiculous you guys are. Come get me. Because I know, I know that while you're coming to try to kill me, you're going to end up drowning you're going to fall off the ship. You're going to accidentally be building a bomb and <laughs> you're going to kill yourself. Because that's how stupid you guys are. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm just being honest. Radical Islam, 
jihadists have got to be the stupidest people on the face of the earth. <laughs> Sharia law, are you serious? <laughs> well, we're all gonna, all the women in the United States are gonna just really be happy to just w walk around with the burqa on. <laughs> all you can see is your. I'm just saying, yeah, really, that's really gonna happen. You're gonna have, you're gonna have some seriously heavy duty women, some seriously butch lesbians carrying AKs coming to get you. And they're gonna kill you. I'm serious. You've never seen the type of lesbian that lives here in the United States. There's some bad. I gotta say it, man. There's some badass women, and I know. That they're not going to tolerate your jihadist bull. Anybody else who watches this, guess what? Radical Muslims, jihadists, probably want to kill you. And if they don't have a reason to yet, even if you're a Muslim or if you're moderate, they want to kill you because you're moderate. Okay, well, if you're not a Muslim, if you're Christian, if you're an atheist, guess what? Radical Muslims want to kill you. So if you really want to find me, I recommend you make these videos go viral. Oh, you'll, there's clues in all my videos that'll indicate where I live or the city and state I'm in. And then maybe one day you'll be on the street or somebody will be on the street. One of your friends from one of your mosques. One of those guys who pretends like he's a moderate, but he's lying. You know, takia, that thing you guys do where you pretend like, oh, I'm, I'm just a moderate. I don't, I don't think that whole thing is wrong. The whole jihad thing is wrong. But really, deep in your heart, you're like, yeah, I'm going to kill all these guys. And that's the whole thing about Islam. What Muhammad would do is he'd kill people, and then he'd take their land and rape their wives. So, I mean, the moderate Muslims, they're kind of sitting back, waiting for the jihadists to come in, kill everybody, kill as many people as they can, and then the moderate ones are going to be the ones who move into their homes and... Find, go through your clothes of your dead body, your dead beheaded body, and pull the keys to your Lexus out. And jump in your car and drive off. That's what the moderates are waiting for. So go ahead and make this video go viral. Eventually somebody's going to recognize me and see me on the street. And there you'll have your chance to get me and kill me. And I'm looking forward to it. I can't wait. Yeah. Come get me. Come on. Don't be scared. <laughs>